Hello guys and welcome back to another video. Today Tunbridge Angels are away to Margate in a pre-season friendly. What are your thoughts on today's game? Yeah, obviously lovely to be able to go and watch Tunbridge with you again, which is um, something we've only been able to do once since February, March time. Um, how long non-league football is going to last in this? Well, we don't know. Let's be optimistic and say it will carry on, but there's obviously going to be a chance that things are going to change in the next few weeks. So we go down to um, Thanet today, look forward to the game, watch the game together, be with the Tunbridge uh, family again. Um, what happens on the pitch is, is not so relevant really, let's just go and enjoy the game. Yeah, so looking forward to today's game, it's uh, friendly against Margate who we've played quite a few times in the past. Um, they play in the Eastern Premier, the 7th tier, and obviously we're in National League South, the 6th tier, so there's a one league difference here. Um, just the things that are going on with coronavirus and stuff, I'm just <laughs> very worried it will all be taken away again. It's been so long without football and it's just going to be, it's, I'm so worried it's going to be taken off again for a long time. What is your prediction for today's game? Um, well, we're in high division. Well, let's hope Tunbridge win then, 2-1. I think it'll be a one-all draw and we'll see you at Hartsdown Park. to Hartsdown Park, the home of Margate. So what are your thoughts on this oh, ground then? It was a stressful journey though, wasn't it? Yeah, oh, we've yeah. done without that. Yeah, we had um, the um, A2 closed for a bit and then it all slowed down. But anyway, we're here now, got it before kickoff. So let's just enjoy the game. Yeah, so um, uh, this is my fifth visit here. So two years ago, August 2018 was the last time we are here. We won 2-0 here. Um, but yeah, it's a three-sided, well, sort of three-sided ground. You can't go around the uh, the dressing room bit, but it's an alright ground, and it looks like it hasn't changed since I was last year. So I'll show you my view around. Oh. 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 Oh! Oh, that's 
Ciao. Time with you here at Hartsdown Park. It's currently Mark 8 0, Tunbridge Angels 1. What are your thoughts on the first half? Looking good, I think. Yeah, looking really good. Practicing a few set pieces, which are going really well as well. Delivery is very, very good. Um, some of the crosses have been very threatening, and I think Mark have done well to deal with it. But deservedly, we're ahead. And the other bit of fantastic news today is to arrive at the ground, and here we signed Arthur Lee again, which is uh, terrific news. One of the best players I've ever seen play for Tunbridge, so I'm delighted to hear that as well. Yeah, it's been, um, it's been quite a boring game, but we went 1 0 up. Um, it's been quite even so far, um, so if this is the last game for a while, then it's a, it's, it, we're doing it very well. Um, hopefully we continue that in the second half. Okay, we're now going back. What did you think? Um, thought it was excellent performance from Tunbridge today. Um, absolutely everything clicked. I think there was a, a bit of a gap between the two sides today. Um, but um, worked very well both formations tried today. The delivery from the set pieces and an open play was very, very good. Um, and um, as I mentioned earlier, I'm very, very excited about the Arthur Lee signing. Although, as I said, I don't know how he's going to get in the side because um, I think Brian Bray and Sonny Moss were both superb last year. So, a lot of competition for places. But a really good day out today. Let's hope it's not the last for a while. Yeah, it's been a very good uh, performance in the second half, especially uh, scoring uh, four goals um, and. 
beating the, the last four games, beating good seventh tier teams convincingly is a very good sign as well. And you know, we were we were supposed to be looking forward to you know new season and stuff and just and just and thinking oh it's nearly going away the coronavirus but no it's coming back and it's it's just so um, annoying and just so sad that we, we could all do all this pre-season and then just have to start again but you know we just concentrate at the moment it's still um, 6th of October so just carry on and, and just hopefully hopefully you can still watch football between football for, for the foreseeable future so yeah don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you all next time bye